Good afternoon, Acadiana. First blush at the weather models. We're going to get a complete model, a new model run coming up before 5 p.m. But Acadiana under the gun for the threat of flooding rains anytime between now and it looks like Sunday morning. Here's the latest uh, high resolution rapid refresh model, also known as predictive radar, indicating an uptick in the shower and thunderstorm activity through this afternoon into early this evening. And the activity continues into this evening. Could see training of a few showers and storms. So some locally heavy rainfall certainly a possibility through the wee morning hours then perhaps a little bit of a break tomorrow morning but more rain and storms on the way as we head into the afternoon and evening hours now timing is going to be different depending on the model and depending on how the storms develop because these thunderstorms are beasts of their own these big thunderstorm clusters and they'll dominate over whatever the model might say but we have to take a look at what the models are telling us and again the futurecast rpm model much the same with storms on the uptick through this evening through tomorrow morning morning, uh, then a bit of a break, and then more storms coming in, perhaps on this model in the afternoon into the evening hours, and then still the threat of lingering showers and storms likely into Sunday, but we think the flood threat will be greatly diminished by Sunday afternoon. Quick look at the model output, and again, this is going to change. This is just rainfall through Saturday evening. We'll say anywhere between one to three will be common, but isolated amounts in the yellow, that's up to six to eight, it is off mainly to our east, but that could certainly be placed across portions of Acadiana as well and the RPM model even hotter on the rainfall with the threat of anywhere between two and six inches of rain and some hot spots showing up here in the pink that corresponds to 10 inch rainfall so hopefully this model is wrong and hopefully maybe some of this activity builds offshore as we go over the next couple of days and intercept some of the moisture moving inland uh, but here you go this is why the flood watch will continue for Acadiana through Saturday we'll have more coming up at 5 p.m.